Is it going? Good. What's going on, guys? It's Dougie Fresh here, about to open a 1989 Fleer basketball wax pack number 61. Number 61. And on the left, I think I want to draw the Diamondbacks going on. Leak pop out to shortstop. Yep. I don't know. Three. One. We should lose out the date tomorrow. Two. Mm -hmm. And three. Jordan, bro. Gotta pull that MJ. Alright. Let's hope we find the air that wore number 23. Right. You're a Knicks fan, right? Bro? Um, neutral. So, neutral. Neutral, yeah. I mean, my favorite player all the time is Shaq. But I didn't really have a team. I mean, my dad grew up, when I was growing up, my dad was a Celtic fan, so... Watched a lot of Celtics Lakers rivalry. So. Ten minutes left on the dice roll game, guys. Hundred dollars in entry. Aces card gets you this nineteen sixty six tops Mickey Mantle card. So hundred dollars a spot gets you a roll. A roll. Two hundred dollars gets you two rolls, and so on and so forth. And then I don't know if you guys saw the last card. Second year Nolan Ryan. There we go. Also, not only with the Nolan Ryan, you also get a $100 break credit. So, 10 minutes left. Try to get yourself some Mickey Mantle magic. All right. Magic. Okay. All right. Spot number one. Tony Rodriguez, who's got most of the pack. So. Patrick Ewing of the New York Knicks. Spot number two, Mike Woodson, who eventually coached the Knicks. Spot number three, which is Sam Potts' one and only card. Terry Catledge, and then the rest of the pack will go to Tony. Spot number four, Terry Teagle. Spot number five, Brad Doherty. Brad Doherty's a good player back in the day. Number one pick, if I'm mistaken, in the 80s. Yeah. A6, yeah. Number one pick in the A6 draft. Spot number six, Dan Shays. How's it going, Dougie? Going oh, good. Going oh, good. Spot number seven. Bill hey, Cartwright. Be the King of Prussia area this weekend. You're welcome to stop by. Yeah, yeah. It's like King Prussia Mall is popular. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Bill Cartwright. Spot.
number eight, Herb Williams. Just notice the next card. And, uh, <laughs> Spot number nine. Talking about who, you know, growing up, um, Larry Bird. So. My dad's favorite player. Tomorrow's always going to be a difficult day. So. Always a constant reminder of him. Spot 10, Joe Barry Carroll. The former New Jersey Nuts, who now play in Brooklyn. What is up, fresh dog? What's going on, Steven? John Battle. I like shocked myself back in the day. You can find his rookies. Yeah, I have um, I have a bunch. I have uh, a bunch of his rookies. I have three of the uh, 92 upper deck. Because for me, like that was one of the first uh, sets I ever collected when I uh, when I started collecting cards. Like eight, nine years old. Um, so I have like two of them graded uh, PSA nine, and then I have uh, two of them un ungraded. Spot twelve, Derek McKee. I got also a bunch of, I think I have the uh, Skybox, Fleer from his rookie year too. Spot 13, Ron Harper. Back in his Cleveland Cavalier days. But yeah, Shaq, uh, yeah, growing up, uh, yeah, Shaq was my favorite. Had uh, an Orlando Magic jersey, a Lakers jersey. A Miami Heat jersey. Um, I know he played. For, I don't think I had a Phoenix one. I didn't have a Celtic one. Spot fourteen. John Sally from the Bad Boy Pistons. I'm really mad. Severino's out for the year. I have a gold card rookie and two. Yeah. Yeah, it's a tough uh, Tommy John surgery for him. So, Horace Grant at number 15. Wrong bowl. Three minutes left in the dice roll game for your chance to potentially win a 1966 Topps Mickey Mantle card. Got to pull the aces. Robbie, you're all set tomorrow for the show? Spot 16. Some Kenny the Jet Smith. The lots. Is it work? The lots. You know about it? He wants to go over with you tomorrow. Yeah, they have to oh, yes. Kenny the Jet Smith. All right. No MJ. It's all right. Next time. Next time, <laughs> yeah. So that was the 1989 Fleer basketball wax pack number 61. Done.